Hey, this is Eric, and this video is one in a series of videos on Google Meet. This video covers how to invite someone to a video meeting with Google Meet. There are several ways you can invite someone to a meeting with Google Meet. One option is to use Google Calendar. Start off by creating the meeting like normal, filling in all the details. Be sure to click the Add Conferencing option to add the Hangouts Meet to the event. Then, over in the Guest section, fill in the names or email addresses of the people you want to invite to the Google Meet. When done, click on the Save button, and Google will send out emails to the guests with the connection information. Each guest will get an email invitation with a link to join the meeting, and the meeting will show up on their Google Calendar with the joining information there as well. Using Google Calendar to invite somebody to a Google Meet is a useful way to do this if you have meetings that are planned ahead of time. Now, if you do not want to send an actual invite through Google Calendar, you can still click on the calendar event and copy the meeting link and then provide that to people whichever way you prefer, such as putting it in a link in a Google document so that they can click on that link to join. Another option for inviting people to the video conference is from inside Google Meet itself. First, start the meeting as normal, either by clicking on an existing meeting or creating a new one. Now you can click on the People button up in the top right hand corner and then click Add People. Here you can enter the name or email address of the folks that you want to invite to the meeting. Click on Send Invite to send them an email with the connection information. If you don't want to send an email, you can also click on the Meeting Details down in the bottom left hand corner and then click Copy Joining Information. Also, if you gave the video meeting a nickname when you created it, you can give that nickname to people and they can simply type that in when joining the meet instead of using the link. However, this nickname can only be used by people within your school and not by people outside of your school domain. You can then paste that information into a Google Doc or into a text or whatever method you would like to to send it out to someone else so that they can join your Google Meet. Another good way to share the link would be through Google Classroom. You can copy the link, and then in Google Classroom, you could post it in the stream or on your classwork page. For example, let's add it to the stream. We'll put in a description, and then click the Add button and add the link in. We'll simply paste in the link we copied, and add that link. We can now post this to the stream and all the students in the class will be able to click that link to join the Google Meet. Now do keep in mind, depending upon the settings for your school, when someone does join your video call, you may need to click a button to approve them and allow them to join, especially if they're not a member of your school domain. Now, after people have joined your Hangouts Meet, you can remove someone from the call if needed. To do that, click on the little People icon in the top right-hand corner, find the person who needs to be removed, click on the little down arrow to the right of their name, and then click on the Remove button. This will remove that person from the call. So those are the basics for how to invite someone to a video meeting with Google Meet. Check out the other videos in this series for more training on how to use Google Meet. The full list can be found at www.controlaltachieve.com slash meetvideos.